what's going on everybody welcome and welcome back to my channel and if you're new here my name is Tay. nice to meet you <laughs> and if you have not yet subscribed baby girl what are you doing what are you doing what are you really doing in today's video this video is going to be kind of different because we are coming to you today with a savings video yes now hold on hold on hold on well y'all think Ashani with a tea saving i'm like saving saving but yeah we are starting to save it is the end of 2021 what better way to save than do the 100 envelope challenge and other challenges that's on pinterest today i'm going to be showing you guys first the first savings challenge that i'm doing and then another one that i found that i'm going to be starting soon so let's get right into the video oh cue the intro first <laughs> First, this 100 envelope challenge has been going around a lot. And first, I seen it on TikTok and then YouTube. And don't mind this. Oh my God, it's got a lot of dandruff. So the first thing I did was I went to the dollar store and I got 80 envelopes and then I got a pack of 40 envelopes and I just combined the two, which is 120, but I did not use the entire 120. I only used 100. So what you want to do is number your envelope from, well, this is 100, but number your envelopes from 1 to 100. I don't even know where my 1 is. So number your envelopes from 1 to 100. And then depending on the amount on the envelope that's the amount that you're going to be putting in the envelope so for example if i have a hundred dollar bill i'll be putting a hundred dollars in this envelope if i have 99 dollars i'll be putting 99 dollars in this envelope and so on and so on also to keep track of what i've already done and what i haven't done i made a sheet from one to 100 and then when i oh y'all can't see oop. okay i made a chart from one to 100 and the numbers that i did complete i crossed off i literally started this um October 18th and today's day is October 26th so it has approximately been let's add it up 26 minus 18 it only has been eight days and I have filled two four six eight ten twelve thirteen so usually they say um pick two numbers every two weeks you can do it that way um but I've just been going at it so two four six two four six uh, so you would do it every time you get paid. So I started last week. You're kidding. Let me check. Give me a second So as always my camera might die on you guys, but y'all already know the shenanigans. That's why I have extra batteries So it has been eight days since I started this challenge. I started on October 18th. Can y'all see focus? Don't do that to me. Okay, I started on October 18th and now it is October 26th So it has been approximately eight days one week and a one day since I've started this challenge and I've already completed 13 boxes 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 I was only supposed to complete two because you would pick two envelopes per per week or two envelopes bi-weekly but i am literally on the road so there's different ways that you can do this challenge but i really want to get done now they usually say oh it's good to have some type of goal that you want to save for but i have like various goals in my life that i want to accomplish when it comes to money whether it be um a wedding i don't have to be getting married now but it's good to save for that um i do have student loans but i don't want to give that money I want to pay that separately through another stream of income a new car but I really don't need a new car right now but it's good to save for one and then my future apartment is like next in my life I know that for a fact like there's different stuff that I want to save for that's why I'm doing more than one savings challenge so so far like I said I've completed 13 of these and when I literally I either look at my chart this is how I do it I either look at my chart and I say okay what number do I want to do so I pick a number or two and then say if I pick $34 after the $34 I have $15 remaining so I will put it in the 15 instead of taking two envelopes out and I just divvy it up until I have no more money left so what are, what we're gonna do today is we are going to first of all let me tell you what I did so I went to the bank and I I got some funds that I'm going to be stuffing today cuz I'm like I was gonna do it off camera but I was like you know what I might as well do it on camera because uh, why not so I got some funds here it let me tell y'all this is all ones I love ones okay ones is so cute like Look at that, 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 look at that
So these are all ones. We're going to count the ones right now. And then after we count the ones, we are going to choose what envelopes we want to stuff. And then I'll count it on camera for you guys. Baby, and guess what? If y'all know me and y'all know and y'all watch my videos and y'all been here since day one, y'all already know that I've always been ashy. Baby, my knuckles is eczema. So don't worry about it. But i always been ashy. But for this video specifically, I made sure... I made sure that I put some Aquaphor on for that eczema prone skin, okay? I like these hand videos. It's kind of cute. It's kind of aesthetic, you know? But we are going to start counting, baby. I actually love this savings because this type of savings because I can actually physically like this money is tangible unlike the money in the bank like I could put money in the bank and like you know usually I love not having cash but cash is very important in today's day and age it's not all about bank because sometimes you subscribe to some stuff and then it just take money out your account you like where your money at baby when I get paid I'm just like where my money at but right now I'm about to count This is 20. Forty. Sixty. So here we have eighty ones. Eighty. Eighty. We got eighty ones, baby. Eighty ones my sd card ran out of storage and my battery died can y'all see i think you guys can okay so right here we have 80 ones so like i said before i look on my chart to see which one i want to complete now they usually say do all the big numbers first and then do the smaller numbers when it gets a little bit harder but the person i am i will take that money out of that account i don't care okay so i'm going to actually be filling up what i can in the first row so i can at least have the first row or two done i could I just put all the 80 in that envelope that'll be too easy as you can tell by the chart number seven isn't filled and number nine isn't filled so those are the two numbers that i'm going to be filling so we are going to be looking for number seven we got 17 usually people would just shuffle them randomly like there's, there, there, there's different ways to complete this challenge but it's whatever you want to do like you can make it as fun or as boring as you want you can just pick Oh, I got 31. Oh, I got 56. I will not be doing that because if I don't have it, I don't want to keep putting it back. And nah, 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 nah. So I just look for the number. Oh, we got seven here. We got nine here. So those are the two that we're going to be stuffing. And then we're going to be stuffing some more. But we're going to start with these two right now. We're going to be counting seven dollars from right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And putting it in that beautiful, beautiful envelope. I do not lick it. I know I'm not gonna touch the money because I have a goal. Okay, so I put it in the body. And then after that, I take my chart, take a black marker or any marker of your choice, and I cross it off. It is not rocket science, y'all. My X's and O's are all over the place. This, that, that. It's, it's okay because at the end of the day, this is not the money. This is not where the money is. This is where the money is. Okay. Next, we're going to be counting $9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I took up the exact amount. That's great. This is actually a really fun challenge to do. You guys should really try it. And I suggest all people that are young, young and old, but I highly recommend people that are just starting to uh, start their first job. They should really do this. Like, I wish I knew about this back in the day. Maybe I'm a shopaholic. So we got the first row filled. Now, what I also like to do, which I didn't really start yet, but I'm going to do it today. I wanted to document what day I finished my first week. So I'm going to put 1026 here. And I started this literally a week ago. I am so proud of myself. So proud. You got $12, 12 through 19 because I did 11 and 20 already. So we're going to try our best to fill all of these up. This might be $80 in itself or more, but we're going to just fill up what we can we're gonna get our envelopes again first off i think these are all the envelopes i've done i'm gonna show you guys at the end the envelopes that i've done already separate from the ones that did today so we are finding 12 right now oh 12 is right there 13 is right there so we're gonna do 12 and 13 next i'm gonna do it in decency and in order i'm not gonna take out the entire row because what if i don't have that amount for the entire row 
we are going to count basically $25. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So that is for our $12 envelope. Now, at the end of this challenge, you are supposed to have $5,050. So we're going to cross off number 12 on our charts. Bye bye, bad guy. Next is 13. One, two, three, four, five dollars here. And then we have one, two, three, four, five dollars here. And then we take an extra three dollars. So five and five, 10, 13. So we're gonna take our envelope again. It's literally the same process over and over, but I just wanna do a stuffings video because baby, this is actually really fun and I like, I love doing it. Like I said before, I love having tangible money and I'm all about tangible money now. So we fill our $13. So we're going to cross off $13. At the end of this challenge, I'm gonna have so many ones, I'm not gonna know what to do with myself. Also, I was thinking about doing this at the very end, but I don't know. Or I was just thinking about doing it next paycheck. I don't know. Ciao. Anyway, let me know also if you guys like these videos because I will, like, this would be so fun. I'm not all into the budgeting thingy and everything yet, but these videos are really fun to do. So just let me know in the comment section down below if y'all want to know more about saving. Well, I don't know nothing about savings yet. <laughs> I'm just doing a little something, something and seeing if it works. If y'all like these videos, just let me know. And I can just do a staffings video. And I'm also going to be doing a one month update on November 8th. 18th. So look out for that video on November 18th. I will be doing a stuffing video. It might not be up on November 18th, but that would be my one month saving anniversary. So next we're going to be doing 14 and we're going to be doing 15. So we're going to take a lump sum of ones from the one pile. So this is gonna go into the $14 envelope. I know for a fact we are not going to get to the end of this but whatever i have left over i'm gonna put it into the envelope and then i'll just fill that up so next is 15 so we're only going to be counting 14 since we have this one here already now what i'm gonna do is because i'm very curious i have my calculator right here what a coincidence i have my scientific calculator right here that i use in chemistry i'm gonna add up how much money i need for the last four i know i'm not gonna have it right here it just doesn't look like it so we got 16 plus 17 plus 18 plus 19. we need 70 dollars and i know the 70 dollars is not here so we're going to count how much we have right here we only have 10 dollars y'all so what i'm gonna do to make life easier i'm gonna put this in the 16 dollar bin and then i'm going to only have to fill six dollars when i um, and stuffing the remainder of this row. Now, I totally understand when people say it is better to do the bigger numbers first, because now I'm really understanding because for the 16, 17, 18, and 19 is $70. So I totally understand where people are coming from, but if you put your mind to it, you definitely will be able to do it. You just have to stay determined. So I just put add $6 for a reminder. So today I fill one, two, three, four, five, six and a half. Anyway, child, today I filled the 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 9, and a 7. And this was a $80 stuff. I don't know how much this was. But I did this over time and I did this all in once. I'm so proud of myself. I filled 20 envelopes, so that means I have 80 more envelopes to fill. <laughs> Ciao. These are the amount that we have left to fill, which is literally this envelope here. Filled 20, have 80. I'm so scared to get up to like the bigger numbers, but I know I could do it. I just have to budget more, spend less, save more, because you never know when life can hit you. And at the end, I just put everything back into the envelope that it came out of. So I'm gonna clean up and yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you made it to this point, that means you made it to the end. This was a really fun video for me to film and I really wanna do more of these videos because baby, it's all about savings now. Like, I don't know. Since that video, since I seen that video on TikTok, that day literally changed my life. 
2k changed my life so if you guys want to see more of these videos make sure you guys remember to like comment and subscribe turn on your post notifications so you will be notified anytime i do post another video and also comment down below if you want more of these videos just put in the comment save more put in the comment section down below save more if you want more of these videos i will be giving them to you because these videos are kind of easy to do and it's also something that i love to do now and i'm also going to be showing you guys another saving challenge that i'm going to be starting soon so if you guys want to see that video make sure you guys stay tuned like i said before turn on them post notifications so you will be notified anytime that video drops and the holidays are coming soon so we got to start uh, building our money up for that, but I will not be touching anything from that because I do want to see that 5,050 for me. <laughs> anyway, child, thank you guys so much. Without further ado, I'm getting off of her. I'm logging out. Bye.